Did you know that your teeth is mostly porous? What? Like a sponge? No, not quite. The porous part of your tooth, which is called the dentin, is the brown straw-like structure which covers the tooth. And the white part is the enamel. Sometimes when you eat cold food, like ice cream or hot drinks like coffee, your teeth can get really sensitive. Why might you ask? When your dentin tubes are revealed, your nerve ending is exposed, and that causes teeth sensitivity. Scientists have developed a new product called Novamin, which is supposed to treat people with teeth sensitivity. Here's how it works. Novamin comes in the form of toothpaste. While you're brushing your teeth, the bioglass particles mineralize onto your dentin tubules to create a protective layer. So scientists who created Novamin has inspired me to make a fun engineering design challenge for you, where you have to build your own protective layer. The goal of this design challenge is to design and construct a package using the least amount of material to protect your crayon from melting when it's inside the heated chamber. Like this. Alright, first, let me explain to you the test setup. You need to get two oatmeal cans and duct tape them together like this. Find a hair blow dryer, take some crayons, and break them into pieces. So here's what your test setup looks like. So first, there are some rules. Your package cannot be taller than three inches, and it must be inside this chamber. The materials that you can use to build your package are some aluminum foil, any kind of styrofoam material, plates, styrofoam cups, a plastic solo cup, some paper, and some tape. You can use any of these materials to build whatever kind of package you want, as long as it is not taller than three inches and it fits inside this chamber. Well, I'm gonna try and make a package and see what I get. So here's my design. It's pretty simple. I didn't want to use the aluminum foil or the paper because it was gonna be added weight, so I used the bottom of the plastic solo cup for structure and some styrofoam. It's a good heat insulator. It's reusable. So here's how you test your package. Make sure your crayon is inside your package. Make sure your package fits inside the chamber. And once it's in there, all you have to do is take the hair blow dryer, stick it in the chamber, and heat it up for 30 or 45 seconds. 